Hi guys, I'm here today. It's uh, quite late, but I decided there's no time like now to do my fall Fab Fit Fun unboxing. So Fab Fit Fun is a seasonal subscription box that um, you can get and you can have up to five items customized each, each season if you are a subscriber. I am an annual subscriber, which allows me to customize five out of the eight full-size products that come in each box and uh, if you are a seasonal subscriber you get to customize three categories so the difference is that a seasonal you pay $49.99 each season right before the box comes out and as an annual you pay once for four upcoming boxes and you get a slight discount which adds up to 45 and that's American dollars in Canada, we do pay shipping as well as an extra $8 per box and all prices are in uh, USD. But uh, it's amazing that they ship to us and so far all the products I've wanted, I'm able to get and they are a box that are available in the UK as well. I love my Fat Fit Fun box. It is fun. It was gifted to me. Um, my first annual um, subscription and I think I'll continue to subscribe to it is you know four times a year I get something that you know customized for me and I treat it mainly if it, anyone is a caretaker out there whether you are a parent or you take care of your parents or other people you know that sometimes it's really hard to prioritize yourself FabFitFun does that for me I'm gonna do my fall unboxing because on Friday for annual members, we get you um, the window for customization for our winter box open. So I figured, you know what, else? there's some items in there that I remember I selected that I really want. And I wanted to open and share with you guys. I didn't do before because I was waiting for the perfect moment to make this video, but I figured there is no time like today. On a side note, there's this amazing unboxer. She's linked down below on my subscription box. Uh, Jessica from Everything Proof Beauty. I do recommend you follow her channel as well if you like unboxing. She always does amazing spoilers for Fed Fit Fun. She's on the ball and she rates all the products that are in it, including from the add-on list. And she lets you know exactly what ingredients are in it and whether she recommends it and if she doesn't, why. So please, please, if you like unboxing, I want you to go up there, hop on Jessica's website, and uh, just let her know that Paulina sent her. Well, Frosta wings it. But anyway, I hope you show her support. And if you're ready, let's get unboxing. And I know that was so lame. I'm sorry, but I am excited and I don't know what to do. When, the one thing that I want to mention is right now they started uh, FabFitFun is going towards a more sustainable line. And they have started by now having all their uh, seasonal boxes come in in craft paper, reducing the amount of ink and the size of the boxes that they do use. Everything inside... Now, it's also wrapped with um, craft paper instead of um, plastic, which I do appreciate the effort. At least they're trying to cut down where they can. And another good thing about FabFitFun, well, two things. One, a great thing about being a subscriber is that you have access to their FabFitFun TV that gives you not only some recipe ideas, but they have some really great workout programs. And they are free for subscribers. And another great thing is with each box, you do receive this little magazine. So it is a magazine that will give you information on your box. Inside, it shows everything, each of the customizations that you could have chosen or you could have gotten. And so it shows the value of everything. And then it has some lifestyle things like, you know, home decor, horoscope, and um, pumpkin spice recipes, why not? And other recipes as well. But it also tells you about some of their highlighted products. But each season, they partner with um, a different charity. And they highlight someone on the cover. And it's usually a celebrity that brings 
one of the causes uh, to the forefront. It is, it's a good, nice, easy, quick read. And sometimes at the end, they will give you a little hint and there are some activities, you know, for, you know, puzzle people out there. So without further ado, let's get going. What, well, I, I do a lot already, but you know what? What else? Uh, they sometimes do give you some coupons for the partners. Oh yes. So I am not affiliated with FabFitFund at all. I did pay for my own box. I'm far from, like far from their PR list. But as a subscriber and anyone that does subscribe, you get um, a referral code that gives anyone who subscribes $10 off their first box. And then that gives me an incentive as well that I can spend on my future boxes. So I'll link my code down below. If you want $10 off your folks, uh, first box, if you subscribe, feel free to use that um, code. I appreciate it and I guarantee you won't regret it. Who doesn't like a discount right so just link um just read my description code and i'll probably link the code on my comments as well so the first thing i got in here it was one of the items that i did not select they selected for me so like i said you get up to eight uh full-size products as an annual subscriber choose five but there's three categories that they randomly select something for you sometimes based on your previous choices this one I'm loving it's my pumpkin spice patty in a box. And I love pumpkin spice. My feet always suffers. Oh, there's two treatments and four steps. So there's a salt soak, a sugar scrub, a mud mask for your feet, and the massage butter. Awesome, can't wait to do that. I don't know if I, I love pumpkin spice, but I don't know if I should do it now or save it for the summer. That's when my feet need more love and I don't know about you and I'm a flip-flop wearer. I do not like socks at all. So I barefoot whenever I can in the summer and sometimes my feet pay for it. Ooh, this one is something I selected. It is a multi vitamin mask it comes with five facial masks and that's one of the things i love about the box right it's uh these are never things that i would buy for myself because i would feel so guilty but it comes in a box and i select it and it's amazing and you know what i'm trying to wear my more makeup now it started with uh during quarantine more self-care that was much needed for my mental health so i started to using a little more makeup and i came up with a night routine for my skin i'm not getting any younger but also you know moisture is moisture everybody loves it and every skin does too equally regardless of how old you are so i got this mask and i have high hopes for it i'll let you know how it goes this is another item that i did not select it was selected for me when i saw that it gave me that i won't lie I was a little bit disappointed, but you know, maybe you'll be pleasantly surprised. It is a nourished with coconut oil, um, with coconut and argan oil, is glow milk. Illuminating milk for face and body. It's like, I'm very basic, you guys. I don't like a lot of things, and I don't know if you can see it, this for me is just, borderline too much it's not a, like i already glow a bit it's not like i want to glow anymore and it feels i'm not the palest person in the whole entire world but this feels like a little dark i don't know if you can see it and then i'll just and there you go it feels like maybe it's a little bit of like a liquid bronzer and it sparkles a little bit i don't know I'll see if I can find some use to it. This next item is also something that I did not select it. They selected for me. And it was the one thing that I was hoping I wouldn't get, but I did. I'll be happy with what I get. It is Perfect Repair Treatment Mask by Natural Lab. 
It is a hair mask. And ever since my hair fell and it started growing up, I'm very conscious about um, and careful with the products that I do put in my hair. I've been using Functional Beauty because they're an all natural product, but that's another video. And um, a little goes a long way. I have no use for a hair mask, but I got it. Maybe you'll like it, who knows? Maybe I'll give her a try. This is something that I chose. It's called Harper and Ari Juice Cleanser Exfoliating Sugar Cubes. I'm very excited for this. Uh, my skin does tend, I don't know if you could see it, there you go. It tends to get dry. And uh, these are like darn cute. Like it's little tiny sugar cubes that you just cut, cut it up or use the whole thing and you just scrub your body with it like soap in the shower or bath. Love good smelling things and this one just smells sweet and clean and fresh. It smells it does smell divine and I can't really put my finger on it what the scent is supposed to be like. It doesn't seem but I dig I dig. Um, what should I go next? Okay, this is another one that I selected as well. As an annual member, this was something that I could customize. And if for seasonal subscribers, this was part of a category that you don't subscribe. You, you can't choose. But as an annual, I got to choose. Like I have, I have enough bottles right now, especially because I'm trying to live a more sustainable lifestyle but um i saw this one and out of everything there i just um couldn't pass on it because it's something that i can even leave at work now that i'm back at work it has a it's a mason jar hydration kit it has this neoprene sleeve which i like because it keeps it a bit protected and it keeps the drink colder or Hotter if you want, mason jars is glass, so you can use it for hot or cold. Um, oh, that's a good thing. I don't know where I should use it for. Maybe tea hmm. or water. What is good is my favorite. Why did I smell that? I don't know. It smells like nothing, guys. <laughs> Maybe that's a good thing. And I'm not really a fan of blue or tea or anything like that. But most people are. And again, I love mason jars and I thought... <laughs> this would be a good idea. And um, I think this is my first glass one. I most, mo not most, all of my mason jars, all of my water bottles, with the exception of my Momento ones are metal. So this is something that everybody could choose from. It's a category that everybody could choose from. And I'm really excited for it. We're getting, I live in Canada, you guys, and it's getting chilly i'm telling you and wet and i was looking forward to this i don't know if you can seal it in its full glory but it is i want to get a magazine because they had um a name for it that i was finding funny that's 2d it's a woven scarf again with fringe I don't really care for fringes either way, but I don't know if you can see it, see it in all its glory. It's almost like a cardigan, but it's also a scarf, and it feels so soft and warm, you guys, and you can wear it like this, maybe watching TV or going to the movies or just talking to your friend, you know, social distancing on your porch, and you can keep warm or you can just wrap around and just walk around on those super cold days that I know are coming. Minus 20, what's that? I don't feel like, as I have my scarf again, but no, probably at that point I will be wearing my winter coat. But this has exceeded my expectations. I expect it to be nice and soft and warm, and this is even more than that. It's also very lightweight 
and it doesn't feel prickly or anything. I mean, I just put it on for 30 seconds. But sometimes if it's something that I, I'm very texture oriented. So if it's something that I don't like, I can feel it right away. And I have high hopes for this. Guess what I'm wearing to work tomorrow. Finally. And last of my box is also something that I chose from. They had two options for little bags. This is a Butcare New York uh, faux leather bag. It has two real functional pockets at the front and then there's quite enough room it has enough room for my sustainable kit and my wallet and uh my mask and there's another room in here and it's nice and short and i'll have to adjust it for me but it will feel good and sometimes you know being busy and going up and down and um I do like being hands-free. I am not a very big tote person. All my purses tend to be, not even tend to be crossbar or something. I just, I enjoy freedom in any way, shape or form. I can find it and that includes my bag. So like just the fact that it is a backpack, it's good for the back for me anyway, because I tend to carry a lot of things. Oh, I can even fit some books in there. Or maybe not too many books, but you know, I'm trying to get into Audible and audiobooks and ebooks and things like that. I like the smell and taste and feel of books. I've read some really good ones recently that I'll share with you. Uh, but um, sometimes I do digress. So back to my box, which I'm almost done. So just so you know, they give you also the value of everything that you can find. So I know based on my email and my profile, my box is worth $321, which for $45, that's a big like deal. Of course, they overinflate the price of some things, but I still think it's worth it. So my purse, the backpack, it, it has a retail value of $100. My second item was this scarf again. It has a retail value of $85. My third item from the third category was my multivitamin mask. And that has a retail value of $40. The Mason Tops glass water bottle with neoprene and turquoise has a retail value of $35. And then on five, I had the sugar scrub, carpenter exfoliating sugar cubes and juice cleanse has a retail value of $16. My sixth item, pumpkin spice patty in a box has a retail value of $20. My seventh item was the wonderful hair mask of a retail value of $16. And the last item I got was uh, the Glow Milk. And it has a retail value of $19.50. Overall, I'm really happy with the box. I mean, on, between this car and the backpack alone, I just made three times. I got three times the value that I put it in there and it's always amazing to just boom, 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 go there and you know, four times a year you get something you know, just for you. And uh, who doesn't like to be treated? It's like I always feel special when my box comes. And uh, I just, I am looking forward for Friday when I get to customize my winter box, I already saw some spoilers. I have an idea of some of the things I do want and I'm very um, excited, especially for category one, two, and three. And if you're curious about what's in them, just go check the, my girl, Jess, uh, Everything Proof Beauty um, YouTube channel and you can be spoiled by her. And if you have um, also questions about more of the products that I got and where they made off and whether she recommends or not and she does a really deep dive in the ingredients list 
show her some support and i hope you enjoy this i know is um i don't know let me know in the comments below do you like unboxings do you want me to keep doing this i have a couple of other subscriptions that i can do that too or i can do some hauls i really do like watching unboxing because it's so fun and like sometimes even if i can't get something because it's us only it's uh it's excited to see someone excited or see the things that you know are out there and um i hope you enjoyed my unboxing i know i rambled a lot i don't even think i'm gonna edit this otherwise i'm not gonna post it but thank you for being here with me today and uh for and i do apologize i haven't opened this before but you know what winter box is coming so this is a better time than when i got in mid fall because we live in canada so shipping was a little delayed but anyway for the millionth time thank you for being here with me today and doing this unboxing and until next time be the hummingbird